basically said, do you want to go to space? And immediately I said, yes, yes, absolutely. I actually got to visit NASA in Houston a few months before I was diagnosed with cancer. And whenever I got to see where the astronauts trained, like, of course I wanted to be an astronaut. But then a few months later, I was diagnosed with cancer and it really changed my whole world. Until now, astronauts have had to really be physically perfect, um, which is not a category that I fall into because of surgeries I've had on my leg. Um, and that's one thing I'm so excited about with this mission is it is opening space travel up to anyone. I got a phone call pretty much out of the blue in early January. It was from St. Jude and they told me the background of the mission. And then they basically said, do you want to go to space? I called my mom and I, I told her about it and she was just as shocked as I was. And I said, you know, I can't pass out this opportunity. And then I called my brother and sister-in-law who are actually both aerospace engineers. They were fully supportive as well. And, um, and they just really reassured me how safe space travel is. And so I was able to give my, my definite yes. With my role in this, I really hope to inspire patients going through cancer treatment and other survivors that anything is possible. You know, I never thought I'd be going to space. Um, and I would just love to inspire my patients to, to dream big.